today's video I'm going to be reviewing Hornady Black um, 40 caliber 180 grain with an XTP bullet I reviewed these in 9 millimeters and they worked very well you can see the regular hollow point and I'll be using a Smith & Wesson 40 cal SD 40 VE for testing we're going to shoot this through some ballistics gel um, with a piece of fiberboard stimulating bone and two pieces of t-shirt material and one piece of uh, flannel and we're going to shoot a water jug for energy transfer a coconut uh, representing zombie skull and a um, cantaloupe um, just soft tissue damage so uh, let's get to it 100. Okay, here is the the hole that the uh, round put through the cardboard and it also cracked it. Um, I was a little to the side and down with this. Here's the front block. As you can see, got pieces of, of uh, fabric in there. And then there was the thing. And here's the second piece of gel. We dragged pieces of uh, MDF through here. About two inches wide wound channel. And then it came into this block. From this side behind me. Came into this block. Good expansion and it stopped right here. Um, not sure of the length, but probably close to 16 inches. Then I fired a second round through the gel, bear gel. Went in here. See, it's about two and a half, three inches wide wound track. Then it came to rest in this block. Probably another 15, 16 inches. Also showing good expansion on that round. Here's a front look at the uh, cross section of the wound damage.
So after testing, um, I don't, I don't know if it was this ammunition or the firearm. It's a brand new gun and it has uh, less than 50 rounds through it, including the 20 from today. Um, possibly needs to be oiled, um, broken in. I'm going to revisit this test after uh, put a couple of hundred rounds through it. Three malfunctions out of 20 with this ammo and zero with the first 20 uh, Sierra Sportsmaster that I put through this. But um, they expanded well. They had good penetration and um, were fairly consistent. 